I'm going to show you how to use many push buttons with Arduino. On this image you see an example on how to connect a digital pin 2 on the Arduino to a push button. Uh, you will start by putting the 5 volts and connecting them to this pin and this pin here should be connected to 10 kilo ohms of uh, 10 kilo ohm resistor that should be connected then to connect it then to Arduino ground. The other side here against the resistor should be connected to the digital pin. Um, this one you don't think need to think about. This is how I have already connected the pins, the buttons. This button here is connected to the digital pin 6 and the next one is connected to digital pin 7, this one to digital pin 8, 9 and 10. This one goes to ground and this one goes to plus 5 volts. Plus 5 volts here go to here, 5 volts. And the ground 10k resistors, they go to ground. To make things easier, I wrote a small library. I always use this library when I use buttons in my project. I share it on GitHub. Let's get it from there. The location of the library, you can get it from here. This is my path, path to my libraries. Let's go to the GitHub. It's github.com. Go to H push buttons. You, you to download it to libraries. It's there. Extract it here. Delete the shift. And rename the folder, remove the master. Now we can start the Arduino again. Examples, push buttons, on, off, example. And here is the example. I am using the Arduino Nano. I'm going to connect it to the computer. It's connected. I'm going to send these circuits to the Nano. Okay, the sketch is running. And when I press this one, nothing happens, and this one turns the lights off, light off. So the buttons are working. It's very easy to use. You only need to read the description how you connect it. Uh, but this is how you use it. You start by including the library. Here in this array, you tell the library which pins are connected to buttons. So this would be button. So this would be button one. Now the library knows that they are connected to six and seven. This is the left uh, begin state. This is so you can see what is happening. So you can be see what's happening around pressing the buttons. And you see the state on which buttons I'm pressing. This is the whole program. It's very easy to use. I use it in all my projects now. I have connected three more buttons. So I'm gonna add them. And turn. And these buttons are here, here. And I'm going to keep on using the LED just to show you. Uh, as you see, there's nothing working when I press here. Just the first two. 
now I'm gonna add the flash five and now I've connected more buttons. That's all you need to do. And I press so you can see what's happening.